Today we're going to focus on a very famous rock lick, uh, the opening to Ozzy Osbourne's hit song Crazy Train. This lick is based around our root position pentatonic box that we've been working on for a while. So we're going to move that box into second position, which puts it in F sharp minor or A major. And all the notes of this lick are going to be based around the notes of this pentatonic box. So if you keep the framework of that box shape, this is going to be easy. So if you take a look at the tab, the tab's going to spell out how to do this. We're going to go ahead and start with our first finger in the second position. So we're going to keep that first finger set at the second fret. And as you can see in the tab, we start on the sixth string going two, two, fourth fret of the fifth string, back to two of the sixth. Fifth fret with your pinky outside of the pentatonic box, but still around the shape on the fifth string. Back to the fourth string, back to the second fret of the sixth string. Back to the fourth fret. To the second fret under your bar on the fifth string. Fifth fret of the sixth string. Fourth fret, back to fifth. Back to under the bar on the fifth string. Fifth, fourth, open. So you have. Two, two, four, two, five, two, four, two, two, five, four, five, two, five, four, open. That's the opening lick. And you can see it really is based around the pentatonic box that we've been practicing for a while. Now, now, In the right hand, there's an interesting thing that occurs. Randy Rhodes, the guitarist for Ozzy Osbourne at this time, uses something called inside picking. What inside picking means is, we're going to play and pick notes on the fifth and sixth string, but we're going to keep our pick in between those two strings. This technique allows us to actually go crazy fast while being articulate. So if you look at the right hand, I kind of am living a little bit inside that space between the fifth and sixth string. I hope this helps you to get the lick of uh, Crazy Train, and I look forward to hearing you play it.